Hey guys, this is Japan Crate of December. Now, me, Luna, and Lily have been fighting over the box, and Luna has won. And it looks like Lily is finally over there with her, so I can make my video. Lily was biting the crap out of my hand. So, I will show you the mini, the original, and the premium. The premiums are $35. I think the mini are $18. Don't quote me. Um, if you get the premium, you get everything plus a drink and bonus of Kit Kats. Um, ah! Don't fall, don't fall. <laughs> so, let's see what we have. So, we have this bag of chips. It is three cheese flavored for a great tasting pizza. So, this is called Rich Pizza um, Cheese Chips. They are actually delicious. I love cheesy stuff. I'm not done with them yet. But the smaller chips are down in there now. And they have like little chunks of what I believe to be cheddar cheese on them. The next item was a bear shaped grape jelly. A dashi candy. This is an apple hard candy. Um, what is it called? A wadima apple. This is a mini bottle. It has powdered soda in it. This one is strawberry flavored. I will give this to my sister because I do not eat the strawberry flavored ones. They always send me strawberry stuff. There was also cider, which I wouldn't mind, and lemon. This is a waffle dipped in chocolate. A buttery waffle, it says. And this is what you would have got in the mini by itself. Really? Is this what we're going to do? We're just going to keep attacking everything? Well, I'm glad I took the things that I wanted out of that bag already. So this is the Black Thunder Shareable Christmas Bag. Um, Black Thunder is like a traditional Japanese candy type thing. It's it's just a chocolate bar with Rice Krispies and covered in cocoa. Um, sometimes there's peanuts in it, but it's pretty much the same formula all the time. But they had six different designs in this one for their Christmas theme. So I'm assuming this is Santa Claus. Because I thought that it was an elf at first, but... Yeah, adorbs. Then we had our DIY, which was a no machu melon jelly. So it had a cup, a straw, and a powder. And you make a jelly you can drink. Oh, it's gotten pretty thick. I didn't know how much water I should have added to... I would add more right now, but I can't. Because the other item made me spit it out. So I spit it out in the water. Ah! Yeah, I can't drink this anymore. It's too thick. But in Japan, they have a lot of jelly drinks. Sometimes it's just juice, and then they put like little squares of jelly stuff in it. I wonder, can I put this? <laughs> yeah, I don't want to test that out too much. Let's see. Our next item is, I normally just call these a boo-boos, um, a, a boo, un, un, me, a boo. I don't know. I call these a boo-boos because I don't remember anyone actually saying the name of these, but this is just a chocolate stick puff. Now, this is a, the gacha candy, which is a penny candy in Japan. And 
they have so many different flavors. Um, vegetable garden flavor, which I think is delicious. There's hamburger, there's pizza, there's teriyaki, shrimp flavored, all kinds of insane flavors. Then we have this. What is this? Is this the ramené? This is a soda gum. I think this is ramené flavor. Which, if anybody doesn't know, ramené flavor is like their original soda flavor. It, it. I can't really describe what that flavor is. You would have to try it for yourself. But you can chew this gum and it has a little fizzy action inside of it. There was one more thing. Thing. Where is it? Mario! Where are you? Lily, are you laying on Mario? Curious. And you got a piece of Super Mario Wii gum. I do not believe there is a sticker in it. I believe that it was just gum. And that is everything for the original box. Uh, now, if Lily does not try and bite my hand off, I can... Yes. So this right here disturbs me. <laughs> this is a salted ramen grapefruit flavored tablet. I do not like it. I love grapefruit and I tasted the grapefruit for a good second and then that saltiness came. I am not one of those people that put salt on their oranges and grapefruit and watermelons. I just eat them as they are so this disappointed me. <laughs> um, yeah, but it says that it contains 90% of glucose to help you energize your brain and body but you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take it to work and I'm going to give it to the kids and I'm going to smile and watch their faces as they stare at me angrily <laughs> because that's what I do I love doing it and since Christmas is here It'll just be another treat for them. Wahaha. So, before I end up getting attacked by the crazy trio, well, Twino, um, I don't know what this is. This is Super She Geek Ick Cusa Melon Cream Soda? Uh, I can, uh uh. If y'all want to look at this, because I do not know how to say that. She Geek Ick Queso? I can't read. I don't know how to pronounce those. <laughs> so this is a cream soda collaborated with Shy Geek chew gum to bring the best of both worlds to the super sour melon soda candy that will leave your lips puckered. Okay, but it's... I want to try it. I'm going to try it. Oh, wow. These are big tablets. Are those holes? Ugh, come on. Oh yeah, ah! Nah, nah. Oh no. You can do it. Maybe it's just on the outside. Oh. Okay. 
I got it. Yeah. Goodness, it's just like Mexican candy when you have to, you have to lick all that chili and hot sauce and stuff off before you can get to the sweet candy. I forgot that it said that it's chewy. I was kind of hoping to like just break it in half. No, this is this is really chewy. Like, oh, it's clear now. Yeah, I guess I'll be chewing this for a good minute. <laughs> Definitely something I can... Well, they may not trust me after the grapefruit salted candy. <laughs> okay, so the next item... What is this comedian candy? Oh, is this one of those lucky things? Like a chameleon whose aim is to trick and deceive the naked eye, these heart candies do just the same with your taste. Is this another sour candy? Starting as a cola candy, as it dissolves the flavor, the color changes to reveal different flavors. What flavor will you get? Okay. I won't be trying this today. This is a chocolate hit flakes bar. Enjoy crispy chocolate confection with these rice crispy puffs. So this just reminds me of some yeah. Yeah, there's so there's like bags of these that you can buy. And it just looks like they just put them in different packaging. It's to fool the people, I'm telling you. Let's see. This is Sherbert Grape. Try Japanese version of the fun dip of this grape treat featuring a hard candy and a dipstick inside with magic mouth-watering powder. Our bonus item would be these Kit Kats chestnut. Are these limited edition? Ready to keep you in the almond mood, these chestnut Kit Kats are another limited release from Nestle Japan. They feature wafers filled with sweet chestnut cream covered in white chocolate rolls. Now, you can go on eBay and try and buy Kit Kats. Some of them are super, super expensive. Ah, it won't break. This is all right. It's not bad at all. Next, we have this winter edition of the Koala March, which I am so happy to see this thing in a different packaging. This is adorable. I love the silver and white and blue. This is actually a winter cheesecake version. It is a limited release for the holidays. Um, It says that Hokari is a hybrid squash with a deep green skin and deep yellow flesh that is sweet flavored. Um, so I'm assuming that is the filling of this thing. Which I tasted it and it doesn't taste bad. It's not bad at all. Our last item in this box 
is our Coca-Cola Apple. Enjoy Coca-Cola Japan's latest seasonal release designed to capture the taste of fall. This drink was just launched in Japan with a rich, luxurious taste. I won't be trying it right now. I will put in the comments later on when I do try it. And that is everything in the premium box. The premium box itself, if you look at the thumbnail, is very cute. And I will be keeping the box. It is a reversible box also, but Luna is in there and will not get out. So thank you. I can read, or you guys can read, what is happening in Japan right now. Because I thought these were cool. I will be posting more videos soon. I'm hoping to post this today because I actually got this box yesterday. So thanks again, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!